Hey guys, it's me. It's KC. And we'll go back to the Beauty and the Beast major events in Disney Magic Kingdoms. It's Belle! Well, kind of. Kind of Belle. We still have to actually get to her and recruit her, but I'm well on my way to doing that particular thing. What is the character you say? Well, let me show you. But first... Nothing. It is going to be... Chip! Wait, what's that? Some of you are saying that's not the right chip? Well, you are correct. There's actually two chips in the game right now. This one is permanent. It is the newest characters in the game. The other one is actually part of the event, and it is... Teacup Chip! It's this character in the middle! Right there! So it is 250 gems. It is fairly pricey. But it's also, I think, a deal as well if you want to go for Chip. Let me just double check though, just to make sure. I want to check the deals. Yeah, it's the it's the Chip bundle on the far right there. You get Chip plus a, a building. I don't know what it actually is, but it's 10 bucks. Keep in mind, this is Canadian money. The American price will be cheaper, and depending on where you live, it could even be more expensive. But it's 10 bucks for me. And since I already have the gems, I'm going to skip this deal. The 399 one though was a lot better, I think. It was like 5 bucks or 6 bucks or something for me, so... It was cheaper, but again, I had the gems. So what's the point of spending the money, I guess? Anyway. Let us go for the adorable little chip. Goodbye, gems. See you later. Oh, he's so cute! Ah. Uh, boop. So there's Chip. They're fairly large, actually, all things considered. I mean, they're not as large, even close to the, to the teapot. But for being so small, it's definitely fairly large. It's probably so that you can actually see them. Wow, everything here is new. Well, it would be if this is your first time. If I were a kid, I'd run around and look at everything, and talk to everyone, and make as many friends as fast as I could. But I guess I'm a cup again, and it is harder to do all of that fast when you don't have legs. You sort of have to hop around. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. Go exploring. Good old Chip, what do you got for quests? You got time to go exploring, obviously. Excited Wander. Which drops the the ears for Belle. Exploring for fun. I I don't I mean I know what that's supposed to be. It's supposed to be like a, a plate. But for who? Probably for Chip. Help with the show? History lessons. Story time, and I still have to get Belle. Settle in for bedtime. There's the teapot. Check out Belle's house, ideas for fun, and finally, watch out for Gaston. Well, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go exploring! There he, there he be! Ah, so cute. Hey. First of all, you said you were gonna hop. You're twirling. You're hop twirling. Someone's a liar. Oh, but you're so cute, I can't stay mad at you. Well, I guess I'll let you hop around for a little while. Next up is going to be Belle. And Belle popped up earlier this morning. The date would have been March 17th, in case you're watching, 2017. If you're watching this video a lot later. And here's what I got for Belle. So I've got 22 of the roses. Which, it seems like a lot, but I don't really know moving forward how many more... Or if I have to get any more moving forward. Especially with Gaston towards the end. We've got... Golden Gloves. So these are all the different characters. Lemire, Chip, Bio Guest Restaurant, which is premium. Maybe that was the building that came with Chip. Submit files. There's a chess. Her and him. Now we got the Bell Ear Hats, which is you. Be in the Beast Float if you want to go the premium route. Bell's house drops one, Minnie, Beast, 
chess chip. And this dude, what's his name again? Sergeant whatever. So there's not really a lot of characters, especially if you don't buy any of the premium stuff. So it can probably take a lot longer, but hey, you know what? It's okay. We still have a lot of time. Also, 16,000 of the currency. That is a lot. Oh yeah, speaking of Bell and the chests, some of you might be wondering, well, what particular chests are needed for the items for that character? Well, let me show you. It's not the bronze, which I wish was the case because it's only three hours. It's the silver. And this is actually a good thing because I was expecting it to be gold. Earlier on in the update, when we first started, it was the bronze chest, and then I think it moved to the silver. I think it moved to silver with the latest character before, which was Lumiere. So I was thinking Bell's gonna be gold. So it hasn't gotten progressively more difficult yet, but I'm thinking Gaston will probably be gold. That's just a complete guess, so I'm hoping not. Maybe he should go back to bronze. That would be fantastic, wouldn't it? But yeah, silver with Bell. Get those chests. I'm actually wondering, by the way, before we wrap this up, is that where's Gaston on this list? Because Bell is the final character and I can't scroll or anything like that, but if you go to the list down below, and you go towards the very end, you welcome Gaston. So I don't know why he's not on the top tab, but you can get the character, as you can see there, but that's, <laughs> that's a long way to wait. Oh yeah, by the way, Get Beast's formal suits, get Belle's formal dress. These are going to be mandatory on your quest to getting Gaston. And if you're wondering what that actually is, it's right here. And there is Belle's formal dress. Very, very pretty. Yeah, nine and a half days. Long way to go. And there's his formal suits. Same deal, nine and a half days to go. It's all going to depend in these nine and a half days where you have to get Belle. The Hunter's Lair, you're going to have to probably battle Gaston, yeah, drive him off. So there's a lot of work to do between now and these nine and a half days. Well, what do you mean there's nothing in the leaderboard? Actually, the leaderboard just ended and there was a particular building, or I guess it would be a decoration that you could get if you ranked in the top 50. I just found out though that you could actually get that item still if you didn't get it in the leaderboard. In the chests! Check it out! Look down below. In the silver chest, there's like the croissant stand. So that's a bit of a kicker for people like me who really, really worked hard to get it. But now I'll get two. I am going to put down though, two more items. Two more items. Let me show you the items. Three items actually. <laughs> croissant stand. It is an instant build. We'll place this down. Let's place this over here. Nice. So that's what it looks like. I really love croissants, by the way. They are amazing. We're not done, though. We got more items to place down. We have got the Enchanted Tiki Room. This is available as a one year anniversary because the developer was so cool. Every single day for five days, we would get a brand new item. So we ended up getting a golden chest, silver chest. We ended up getting, at the very end, the enchanted tiki room. So let's place this down. Construction time is also instant, which is fantastic. Look at you. Look at you. That's really trippy. Really, really trippy. It's cool. It's just weird. Not that I have anything against Tiki stuff. I just, it's just rather random, I guess, for a prize. Got an animation. It looks really, really cool. Can't complain about that. Now the biggie. This is an item I've been trying to get forever in this game. It is the Sea Serpent Swing. I think this was available in, I gotta say, it was probably the Platinum Chest. That was one of the Items you could get, by the way, I think. In terms of uh, the different every single day prizes. On the way to getting the Tiki Room. Do I have any space over here? I do. Ooh, baby, I love that. Hold on. Whew. 
Oh, baby, I love that. That's amazing. Look at that. It reminds me of that one ride where it goes back and forth. I think they call it like the pirate ship or something. If you've ever been on that sort of ride. Fun fact, I hate rides like these because it really gives me an upset stomach. I'm a big baby. My stomach can't handle that sort of stuff, so I get sick. Really? Oh god, look at that. No way in hell would I ever go on a ride like that. Yeah, so I can't handle this sort of stuff. I get sick really easy. I'll stick to the kitty choo-choo train. Thank you very much. Choo-choo! If it rocked like a baby, I'd be there. But it's not, so I will see you there another time. So thank you everybody so much for watching. If you guys have enjoyed this video, please remember to like, comment, and share. Thanks for watching. My name is Casey, and I will see you on the next one. Bye-bye, guys.